Hey guys, welcome back. So what we're going to be doing here, we're going to be removing some art elements here in this file here. For example, I may want to remove the numbers with the black circles and the numbers of the buildings. So we will be doing that as an example. Uh, one thing we want to do is we're going to use the selection tool, which is a black tool. And as soon as I select an, an object or an art element, it actually selects everything. So what we want to make sure we do is always ungroup it. So we go to Object Ungroup. Command Shift G or Control Shift G on a PC and then group it. And then I'm going to deselect it and then go back to, into a file to make sure I did it. By the looks of it, I didn't really do it, so I'm going to try that again. So ungroup it. I think I have a weird feeling I actually grouped it by mistake. So once I go ahead and select one of them, I've noticed that I have now selected one object. So I have ungrouped successfully. Let's go ahead and zoom in a bit here and I'm going to go in and say delete the number. And then I'm going to also delete the black circles. So along, I'm going to just keep on going around here and I just do so. Now, if you notice here, I'm actually working in a, in a preview mode. You can actually switch over to a wireframe mode, which is outline mode as well. So go view, outline, command Y or control Y on a PC. And you can also, what happens is, is there's no longer a picture, it's now a wireframe mode. Now, if you notice here, I actually physically actually had, when I deleted something, there's also a, a path here. It's actually a straight point here. And what happens is some of these drawings here, there's another one there by the looks of it, I think, right there. These are straight points. So what we can do in Illustrator, we can actually remove all of these all at once. So let's go to Object Path Cleanup. So Object Path Cleanup. And I can select straight points, unpainted objects, and empty text path. Make sure we're going to watch it right here. These are the two items as an example. There's always some other ones as well by the looks of it. And I say OK. And it will should disappear as we soon say OK. Boom. It's gone. And so let's make sure. Yep. It's gone. So let's go ahead and just go ahead and do all that. I'll be right back. So there's also one thing I want to like to show you is color in your file. And so what I've done, I just went ahead and colored some parts of this image here. And I'm going to select, say, the number 37, which is red here. I can select that color, go to Select, Same, and say Fill Color, or Strokes, or whatever. Um, you could pay attention to your file. So if, you, if this image was actually a color file, and you have all these different elements, you can actually go in ahead and actually make things much easier and select things that are the same. So once I've selected it, I hit delete, and they're all gone. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please like it or share it. And also tell people about it.